नमस्कार वेलकम टू गवर्नमेंट ई मार्केट प्लेस इन दिस मॉड्यूल वी विल लर्न अबाउट द बल्क अपडेट फॉर यूटिलिटी सर्विस ऑर्डर दिस मॉड्यूल कवर्स द रिक्वायरमेंट्स एंड प्रोसेस फॉर एनेबलिंग द बल्क पेमेंट अपडेट यूटिलिटी फॉर द सर्विस ऑर्डर्स फॉर बायर्स पी एस और डी डी ओस एंड एच ओ डीज देर आर टू मॉड्यूल्स फॉर द यूटिलिटी बल्क पेमेंट अपडेट सर्विस ऑर्डर बल्क पेमेंट अपडेट सर्विस शिपमेंट लेट्स लुक इन टू द एलिजिबिलिटी क्राइटेरिया Any order where the contract has ended 30 days prior to today is eligible for settlement using this functionality. Only the below first two fields will be mandatory for the user input for order and shipment settlements. Payment date, date on which the payment was made, date format YYYY MMDD. Paid amount this should not exceed the pending amount reference number this would be an optional field for the users there are two modules for bulk payment update module 1 bulk payment update service orders it allows the user to settle the service orders with any pending unpaid amount that is excluding the amount for any existing shipments invoiced of that order the contract for all these service orders should have ended any order settled via this module will be considered as fully settled that is the orders settled through this utility wouldn't appear in the subsequent downloads for the orders which have been settled using this utility the service provider will not get the option to create any fresh invoices Module 2 Bulk Payment Update Service Shipment In this module all the unpaid shipments of service orders that is invoice are already created would be available in the CSV file the bills which are in payment initiated state will not be available Let's see the step by step process for bulk payment update Visit gem.gov.in On the top right corner of the home page you will see a login tab Click on login to proceed On clicking login you will be redirected to your login page On this page enter your gem user ID Then enter the captcha text visible on the screen Click on submit to proceed further Enter your password and click on submit to proceed Click here to access your dashboard. Step 1. To proceed with the bulk update, go to dashboard and click on the bulk payment update. Then click on service orders and from the drop down, select the desired option. Step 2. Click on the generate file option to generate the report for eligible shipments for bulk payment update. Step 3. Once the report has been generated, click on the View Generated Reports option to download the CSV file. Click here to download the generated report. The buyer needs to update the paid amount, payment date, and reference number columns in the downloaded Excel sheet. Then, re-upload the sheet to process the pending payment. Step four. Update the downloaded file with the details of shipments whose bills need to be marked as closed. After updating the file, upload the file by clicking on Choose File. The upload file should be in .csv format and should not exceed 2 megabytes in size. Step five. Once the file is successfully uploaded, the system will give a success prompt. Step 6 After successfully uploading the CSV file the user can view the status of the uploaded file by clicking on view uploaded file details Once the records are successfully processed by the system the status will be updated in the gem seller portal Here are few key takeaways 
This feature allows users to settle service orders by paying any outstanding amounts, excluding the invoiced amount for existing shipments associated with the order. Any order settled using this module will be considered fully settled and will not be included in subsequent downloads. The CSV file will contain all unpaid shipments of service orders with created invoices, excluding bills in the payment initiated state. Once an order has been settled using this utility, the service provider will not be able to generate new invoices for that order. Thank you.